Hi, this is Harbir Singh and today's question was sent in by Satnam Ataru and the question was how do you rehab a torn or dislocated shoulder? It's a great question and this is a common occurrence. It usually happens when someone falls on an outstretched hand, they get a jerk and they get what's known as a shoulder dislocation. They feel their shoulder drop down and then they either move it back into position or they go to a&E or emergency department and they will either do a procedure to bring it back into position or they will give you a mild sedative or even may put you on a general aesthetic to get it back into position. Unfortunately, every time your shoulder dislocates, it's more likely to get further dislocations down the line. Once the capsule is torn, you can't actually heal and repair the capsule. What you can do is strengthen the rotator cuff. Strengthening the rotator cuff will hold the shoulder snug into the shoulder joint but you still have to be careful to avoid doing things that could potentially re-injure the shoulder. So this kind of position is, an, is a no-go no and any kind of activity which could result in a short sharp um, jerk during when your arm is in this position like throwing a baseball for example is also not advised. In order to strengthen the rotator cuff, there's a couple of exercises which are the go-to exercises. One would be face pulls where you bring your arm from this position towards your ears and back down again. And the second one would be your front raise with a dumbbell bringing your arm to 90 degrees and back down again to stabilize the scapula. Beyond these basic rotator cuff exercises, you want to do rope work. Rope work, I've had a previous. And the fourth thing was to use a sling or a support in the initial stages while your shoulder is rehabilitating. Rotator cuff tear, and although it's different to having shoulder dislocation, I found rope work was what really got my shoulder strong again. So what you need to do is grab some of those battle ropes in the gym and then go up and down 10 times, three times, and then go side to side um, 10 times, three times, and then go anti-clockwise circles and clockwise circles. And that's a great routine for building up strength in the shoulder and also endurance. So those are my four tips for strengthening up a shoulder post shoulder dislocation. That's it. I hope you found value in this video. If you did, please share it with somebody else who's suffering from the same problem.